We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. It's recording. Um, hi everyone. We discovered a lethal bacterium today at the Kaoshin Research Facility. It's pretty spooky. Oh. While observing a dead pumpkin, we found some unidentified organisms living inside the seeds. These bacterium can rapidly reproduce and cause deadly effects. But fear not, deadly citizens. We here at the facility have this situation down pat. Well, at least that's what they told me. Um, our boss said that we should make the stuff we do more publicized. Because people nowadays don't really know about this thing, right? Um, so, let's cut to Do Dr. Remo in the lab. Um, Dr. Remo? Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go. I'm Dr. Amo, and that was the intern that we have. I don't even know his name. Props to him for screwing up a line. So I, I'm the head of the research team at Kaoshin. Um, this is not a research fa facility. I actually don't know what this is. So micro, the microbiology department, they found four new antibiotics. Count them. Four new antibiotics. That's a lot, but I get to test them all. They don't know if they work at all. Um, I'm testing them on this bacteria that I'm holding here in this vial. Uh, Why did they give me this vial? I don't know. You can't see it, so I'm going to put a picture there. Um, this bacteria, it can actually kill lots of people, even though it's like so small you can't see it. Uh, yeah, but we can kill it too. So I'm going to teach you how we find out which antibiotic is the best one to get rid of our lethal, life-threatening bacteria. So here is the petri dish. It is sterilized nutrient agar which we will be using to grow the bacteria. The bacteria we will be using is swabbed onto the petri dish like this. So after we do that, we divide the petri dish into four parts like the pizza that I eat because I have no one to share with. <sighs> and we put each antibiotic that's to be tested into each quadrant. The bacteria th grows throughout the dish and we check which antibiotics stop the bacteria from growing the most by checking the zone of inhibition. The zone of inhibition, or ZOI, is a ring around the circumference where the bacteria has not visibly grown. Zone of inhibition is measured in millimeters from the antibiotic to the edge of the zone of inhibition. So, the best antibiotic is C, as shown by this table that was drawn by our lovely artist. Maybe you could teach me how to draw like that. And maybe you could go up for a movie or something later? I don't know. Anyways, C is the best because it has the biggest zone of inhibition. Antibiotic B is second best, but is only half as effective as C. A is mediocre at best, like my job. And antibiotic D is useless like my roommate who never cleans up after himself. And that's basically it. Uh, yeah, that's everything. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What? What do you mean? What do you mean I'm not getting paid for this? Forget this! I'm out of here!